Hello everyone. Now we have to use the open office. For that we have to install it. Along with that we have to connect it with Java. So we need to install both the softwares. I'll tell you how to install them so that you won't face the Java runtime error problem. So I just Google out open office download there. I'll get this link. Just click on this and it will redirect you to this one. Here, if you will see, there are some important hints given for Windows. If you're installing it for the Windows, so I'll just uh, show you what is it. Let me open this link and uh, let's see the information. It is telling you that for 32 bit and 64 bit, what you have to choose. So here they have specified that you will install 32 bit, not 64. When you Google out JRE, you will have these all options. So I'll just click on Java download for all operating system. It will redirect me to this web page here. Uh, you just see download and you have this particular table where you will choose the second option. All right, Windows offline and the file size is this much. So let's start with downloading OpenOffice first. I'll start with, I'll choose my Windows operating system because I have Windows if you have Linux you can choose that one if you have any other version of uh, like Linux or any other operating system you can accordingly choose that then you select your language and of course the latest version I'm going to install so all is set I'll click on download full version and it will start this one within one second now all right so my Download has been started. Let's pause the video and I'll again I'll come back once it is finished. So here you can see that it has been downloaded. Now I'm going to save it and uh, it will take a few minutes to install depending on the network speed of course. So I have downloaded this but I recommend you to create a folder in which this download will go okay so just create the folder with the name open office and just shift that particular download into this folder so that you also keep the jre java uh, file in the same folder so now it's turn to download java i'll just uh, open this site again you click on this one google and find out jre download then you click on this particular site it will redirect to you to this site here you will click on downloads and you will have these options there you will choose the second option windows offline do not use 64 because i already told you you have to download 32 bit which is this one so when you click on this it will download java for you and uh, you can see the download is here now let me show you, pause the video and show you the file after some time. So as I told you, I have kept my OpenOffice and JRE file both in the same folder. Now you will first install this software. So double click to install the software. And then it will take you to the wizard where you have to follow certain steps. And it is really very simple to install OpenOffice. It's free of cost. It will ask for the permission to click on yes. And then it will open the wizard for you. To install the software and here is the wizard yeah so click on next and uh, you can choose the folder where you have to keep it click on unpack so it's a zip file which is going to unpack itself again it is going to take time so let's pause the video here now click on next and uh, it will ask for your email address then username you can add over there you want to add the organization you can add that and then click on next here i will choose a typical option because then i do not want any customization in the software so i want all the softwares there with their default settings so click on next and click on install and it will install the open office package on your system quickly it will do that it won't take more than two or three minutes Click on finish to finish the installation and it will then open up OpenOffice for you. Here is the shortcut key for OpenOffice. 
Now let's uh, install JRE as well. So double click to install this software. Fine. This will open up this dialog box here. You have to click on install. And then the installation will start. Again, I will pause the video until it finish with this installation. Now the installation is over and uh, this message will pop up on your screen. So close that and let's uh, try to open open office. I'll just double click on this shortcut. Otherwise, you can write down in the search bar open office writer or cal or base. It will accordingly open the software for you people. We will be working with writer, calc and base. Basically, three major softwares. I will be making the tutorial on these three software packages. Rest you can explore on your own in, in case you want. So the text document is writer, spreadsheet is calc and uh, database is for base. So let's open the writer over here. I just click on the text document. It will open up writer for me. It's a wonderful feature that from writer itself I can open base. You can see that it's open office writer. There I have the option new and I have database. So let's try to create the database and check whether our JRE problem uh, is solved or not or it will again give me some problem. So I create a new database here and uh, just click on next. Here you just select this option yes register the database for me and click on finish. So it will ask you to save your database there. Let me change the name to to and click on save. Here let's create the table in design view. Alright, I have got my table. It means I do not have any problem as such. So let's state it as numeric. And let me see if I can assign as a primary key. Yes. So I do not have any problem with the JRE. If you in case you have any problem, uh, I'll tell you what you have to do. So let me close this and I don't save this table. You will go to in case you have some problem when creating the table, you will go to the tools menu and you will click on options. There you have to click on Java and just select this option use a Java runtime environment and it should uh, be selected and then it will automatically detect your JRE which you have installed. So this is how you will install OpenOffice and it should not give you any JRE problem. In case you have any problem, do let me know in the comment section and uh, I will try to resolve your problem. Thank you for watching this video. In the next video, we will be covering with writer the styles. Let's see what are the styles, how it can create the styles that it's an important feature in writer. Just going to help you uh, in offices to make your work easier and quicker. Thank you so much for being there.